So Ashley was one of the patients that uh, I took care of from the uh, time of diagnosis. She was age three at the time, and she had uh, a uh, very fearsome disorder. We called it the uh, diffuse intrinsic ponting glioma. Very few people survive. I'd say the fatality is, is in excess of 95%. You say I'm going to be honest. Um, from this 95% of children with that kind of tumor, which I think it is, only five survive, and she got only 3%. I said, wow, Dr. Allenberg, you just tell me her blood is strong. I said, at least I want to do something for her. We then initiated a course of radiation therapy, and she got experimental chemotherapy at that time. So we were in that process about from March 7 until November 21st, 2001. So she has basically um, defied the statistics and then uh, miracle upon miracle with each passing month and year, she remained in, uh, in uh, remission. And it's been maybe 15 years that this happened and um, we are still so much in contact. Making headway is like opportunity for us and family to us and just access because without them, I don't really know where we would be or like what position we'd be in without them. They just constantly, constantly supported us through like everything. They're not really there conditionally. They're just like always there with us. So I think we offer them uh, seven years of help with the family. With psychologists, we offered six years of educational counseling to make sure she got the education she needed. Uh, we always invited her to all our events, and she came. Every year she came to our garden here. She came to the yacht cruise. 24 events she's attended since uh, we started with that family. So it's really trying to help, and that's just one family. There are many families like Ashley's that we've helped as well. So it's it's. It's a pleasure for us to be able to do this for these families. Making Headway Foundation, dedicated to the care, comfort, and cure of children with brain and spinal cord tumors.